Hi, I'm Vanessa Kimes and I'm a Pinterest marketing strategist for creative small businesses. On my YouTube page, you'll find Pinterest tips and strategies to drive traffic to your website using Pinterest. Today's video is all about Pinterest sections and are they a useful marketing skill for your business? In late 2017, Pinterest introduced sections as a way to organize your boards, but are they a useful marketing tool for your business? We're going to talk about that in today's video. Pinterest sections allow you to take a board and separate and categorize pins within that board into sections. Now I can see that this would be really useful from the user perspective. Say you've pinned hundreds and hundreds of pins into a recipe board. You can now separate it into different categories like salads or dinner or drinks, etc., etc. So from the user experience, Pinterest sections are really helpful, but are they useful for the Pinterest marketer? Well, according to a Pinterest webinar, no, they're not that useful for the marketer. Now, the, they basically told us that they would not be searchable. So for right now, you can put keywords in the Pinterest search bar and boards will show up, but they've told us that as of right now, Pinterest sections will not be searchable. So does that mean that you shouldn't be using them in a marketing capacity? I think that yes and no. I think there are better ways to spend your time on Pinterest right now, making sure that your um, Pinterest profile is search optimized with keywords and getting your automation schedule down. But if you have plenty of time and you want to create sections, go for it. One place that it could be helpful to use Pinterest sections, although I don't have a lot of data on this, is if you're an e-commerce site. So for example, if you have a shop board where you list all of the items in your shop into one board and they naturally fit into maybe three or four different categories, it might be a good idea to separate them out. Also, it might be a good idea to take those sections and separate them into your top selling items that would basically get people into your shop and potentially spending more money and buying other products. But for right now, Pinterest sections aren't searchable, so I don't think that you need to spend that much time worrying about whether you should be using them. They could be an added benefit, but for right now, they're really designed for the user experience, and Pinterest is all about increasing the user experience on Pinterest. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you're just getting started with your Pinterest strategy, you can receive my free Pinterest startup guide by grabbing the link below. Or if you want to hear from me more on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to my page for weekly Pinterest tips on driving traffic to your site using Pinterest.